One as baffled by the names, if you think you're outside Ghana, you are mistaken, this is a shaman, a municipality in Accra. The names sound strange and they are many. They include New York, Middle East, Washington, Jerusalem, Lebanon, Switzerland and Jericho among gathers. In Africa, Asia and Europe, names have been corrupted and cannot be easily interpreted or understood. These names do not convey any apparent meaning in the modern language of the area. The names go through processes over time until their obvious meanings are lost. For instance, a place like Adabraka in Accra. This is not a Ga name, it is a corrupted form of an Hausa word. The right pronunciation should have been Alabarika, which means God bless you. Many, unable to easily pronounce the name, end up corrupting it to become Adabraka. Many examples abound. Akotri, now Akrokeri. Second day, now second day. Chebi, now Kibi. British rule also led to change of local names. For example, Edina became Elmina, Simpa became Winneba, Achimfo was known as Salt Pond, and many more. Although the origin of many names of places are now forgotten, likely meanings can be established through considering early forms of the name. Sometimes, place names are changed by new settlers to match local language, completely throwing away the original meaning. In some cases in Ghana, names of towns and villages are given by first settlers and are drawn from the life experiences of those individuals. A shaman, one of the municipalities of the Greater Accra region, is no different. The first man who settled here was a girl man from Tema. His name was Ni Tete Amui the first. When he was coming, he came with his brother called Asai. And we have a surrounding villages. Some people from Tema travel from Tema to those surrounding villages. So from time to time, because Monomania is inland, and then where the brother as I was settling was just along the road, the people traveling to these villages pass the night with Asai, and then by and by Asai became Asai man. Asai man was not the first name. The name for Asai man was Mpoase. Meaning in short, everything. Foreign names dominate the municipality and its environs. Our journey started from Jericho, a community that has seen expansion in buildings. I mean, say, so that for no con to Kwano. After Antokano Mobile, not running some. I know, after some soldiers from Jericho came to settle here, this place was named Jericho after them. Then to Lebanon, a quiet place with tarred roads. For many residents, they are not too sure why the name Lebanon. I was told a man from Lebanon was the first to settle here, and this place was named after him. Then, the famous Washington, not the Washington of the United States of America, but Washington in the Tung Katamanso, an area formerly under Sherman, but now a new district. New York is a large area, but very dusty. Motorbikes are a landmark you will not miss. Here, the Okada business thrives and is profitable due to the poor road. The person where he named this place, you know, he passed away. Meet. So we can't meet, you know, which we did inside. We just follow the name. The next popular name is Switzerland, which is also now under the Tungkatamanso municipality. You will not need an aircraft to go to Switzerland in Tungkatamanso. Middle East is a well-developed area mostly inhabited by the middle class. There was this military man who went to um, Middle East when he was back, he decided to put a building. By then here was bushy, so we can't find any building around. So he decided to put a building and he named around him, where he lives, he named that place Middle East. 
Interpreting some of the names can be difficult if the reason for the name is no longer evident. One thing is clear, almost all the places got their names for the same reasons except New York and Washington. All these places were named after the early settlers. And then if you look at New York, there was a man who didn't get place near the, the, the main uh, station and he was given a plot far inside this is ah this place is very far it is like new york in america so he named new york just because of the distance and nothing else you will be tempted to think the municipality and its surroundings are only identified by foreign names one can also find replication of local communities like Ashama New Town, Official Town, Taifa, Treblo, and many more. It takes you about 45 minutes to drive from Accra to Ashaman on a traffic free day. However, one can spend two hours or more during peak hours. According to the 2010 population and housing census, Ashaman has a population size of over 190,000. For many, the names are an attraction and tells of the great story of the people of Ashaman.